Hi y'all, it's me. I'm here with a couple of hauls. One is online, the other is Tuesday morning. So I'm just going to jump right into it. Um, the first thing I want to share with you is I have been looking for a bow stamp for a really long time. Bow, B-O-W. And I have been searching high and low and I really wanted the Maggie Holmes one. It never came. I thought when all those stamps hit Tuesday morning, maybe it would be there, but it wasn't. So it's from the confetti collection, I believe the bows were. But anyhow, um, I was on search and I've been looking around eBay, Etsy, everywhere trying to find the perfect stamp and I couldn't find what I wanted. But I did find a picture of what I wanted and I sent that picture to this company um, on Etsy. It's Saya Bell Stamps and I dealt with Ashley. She was wonderful from the beginning. She just responded to my emails right away. She showed me what my finished stamp was going to look like if she had made it for me. Um, Mind you, they're not $2 or $3. They're going to cost a little more because they're custom made, but they're beautiful. They come in this little pouch, and here's the bow stamp that I wanted. I was so darn excited that she was able to duplicate this for me from the photograph I sent her because I didn't have a great photo of it, but she got it down to a T. This stamp is so beautiful. It's a wood block, and instead of this being like a sticker that they put on top, it's actually burnt into the wood of the of the stamp really beautiful and then there's the stamp on the background and you could tell I've already been stamping with it in fact I stamped one out so you could see that's the bow and I love it it's just the right size it's exactly what I wanted so Ashley thank you so much and if y'all need a special stamp made I would suggest going and talking to Ashley she was uh, amazing and it was very quickly done and I'm really satisfied so thank you so much Ashley um, next I found one, but this one I found on eBay, and it was a retired stamp from, I'm not sure, Stampendous, I think. It's an old, old stamp from what I've discovered. It's bigger than the one that I had Ashley make for me, um, but it's also lovely, and I'm really happy that I found this one because they're rare to find, but you can tell the difference of the size of the bow. So I really wanted something small like this. I want to use it for handmade embellishments and things like that. Um, for smaller ones, you need something about that size, so I thought it was perfect. So let me move on now that I've shared my bows with you. I'm going to move on to my Tuesday morning haul. And I will start with, I don't know where I'll start. I'll start with this. They have a lot of Project Life stuff right now. And I took this out of the package because I want to show you what's in it. Oh, it's stuck. Sorry, sorry for the noise. I was trying to be ahead of the game. Here's the number, if you can see that and it's a dollar ninety nine and I couldn't pass it up in fact I bought a couple and what this is is um, it's for recipes and you need the binder of course but you can use just about any binder even if the holes don't match you can always um, repunch the holes to what you want but you get all these cute little dividers and I'm in the process of revamping my Look how cute that is, of revamping my cookbook. Um, so I thought these would be absolutely perfect. And the colors of the cards for each category match the tops of the recipe cards for that particular category. So, so cute. So you get like a bunch of those. So that, I bought, you know, multiple packs, so I would have plenty. Um, and each one has like all these information you can rate it you can when to cook it when's the best time of year to have it it's it's amazing it's really good and then you have your conversion chart and you have potluck meals what does this say I didn't even look at all this back stuff here um party time my family's favorites oh, I'm reading on the tops here sorry takeout spots quick cooking and then a weekly schedule. Really cute. So for $1.99, as cute as these cards are, I could not pass it up. And like I said, I did get a couple of them because I'm revamping my cookbook. So that's one thing I got. I picked up a couple of these sticky thumb tape runners because they're always good to have and they're $1.99. Skew numbers there. And then, for no reason other than I thought it was really cute, I picked up this pick of a little camper. Just wanted it to throw in something in my room here. And there's the number. This is with all their party stuff out there in uh, Tuesday morning. I found some ribbons right here. 
And this one I'd already um, hauled before, but they f I found one more. And then they had this one, which I didn't haul before. So um, I thought it was really pretty. Could put some bling or pearls down the center of that. That would be really nice. And these were 99 cents each. Um, they're in the gift wrap section if you're looking. Oops, sorry. Let's see. Oh, I was right to begin with. <laughs> sorry. There you go. The numbers are the same. Um, I found a bow bunny die. This one I've already opened because I was using it. So there's the number there. And it's really small. It's a really small, probably 2 by 2 inch little thing. I found another die, which is this one here, which I thought was really nice. Here's the number. And this one, you could see it there on the card. It's a bride and groom outfit. <laughs> but look at how beautiful that is. I thought this was so pretty. I just wanted it. I couldn't, I don't have a lot of stuff for weddings and that, so I figured why not for, you know, may as well pick it up. Um, I found a Gal Meets Clam 6x6. Uh, six There's the number. And I'm sure you've all seen this, so I'm not going to bother to flip through, but you could see the pages there. Uh, I found some We Are Memory Keeper um, bling. Really cute. And um, I love the colors. $1.19. There's the skew. You can freeze your, um, pause your video if you want to see those, up, uh, the numbers. I found these ephemera packs, which are called In Bloom. I don't have the paper, but it's always good to have ephemera, especially florals and things like that. There's the number, $1.99 each. Got two of those. I found these Paige Evans, um, what do you call them? Uh, paper clips. Sorry, I can't think of the name. <laughs> uh, there's the number right there. Super cute. Got those. I found these vinyl bows that I've seen a few people hauling by Dear Lizzie. They're very cute in person and whimsical. They are $1.49. There's the number. I found some Maggie Holmes Puffy Hearts, which <laughs> there's nothing Maggie Holmes left at my store. It is wiped out. So I was surprised to find that. I've hauled these before, but I picked up a few more. Um, I really like these bows, even though we can make our own. There's a SKU number for you if you need it. $1.49, and they have such cute colors, and so I picked those up. Then into Jen Hatfield, I found this. I'm not sure if this is from her patio party or the other collection that I just found, which is called Along the Way. But um, this says My Bright Life, but I, I imagine they all can go together. And this was $1.99, and there's the skew. This one here is Jen Hatfield. These are some tags, and I'll show them. There's the number, and there's the tags that are in here. Pretty cute. And then I found this 6x8 pad for Jen Hatfield called Along the Way. And there's the number. And it's pretty cute paper, single-sided. So I went ahead and picked this one up too. I think this will go with Patio Party. It almost looks like it will. So I picked that one up. I found these stickers, which um, here's the number. Whoa, right there, $1.99. And I thought these were so cute. They look um, so cute, like patchwork. Really cute. So I got two of those. Almost done. Um, I was really happy, and this is the last group of stuff I've found, but I found the Pink Paisley Whimsical. Um, these are these little um, one by or two by two squares, and they're really cute. They're just little swatches of the paper collection, and then I believe one of them has phrases and like little what the little cut aparts would have, but in miniature. Really cute. I found the paper collection in a six by six. There's the number right there. And super cute. They only had one of these things in the store and really nothing a lot new. But this is so pretty and so cute, colorful, bright. I love it. So that's perfect for summertime. And then I found the thickers that go with that set also. And there's the number there. And there's the little chipboard pieces. So cute. So anyhow, that's my haul. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to visit Saya Bell Stamps and let Ashley know that I sent you if you're looking for something special. I'm sure she'll get it for you. Thank you all so much for watching. Until next time, do what makes you happy. Bye for now.